Report me after game, guys. Teresa has been forgotten for quite a while, and in his own words, it's been 10 years. <sighs> 10 years of imprisonment. But recently he got a nice buff, so I decided to give him a try again. In this match, I decided to play him as a jungler, since nobody in my team seems to play that role. By the way, I just woke up and decided to play a game of Mobile Legends right away. But little did I know that this was going to turn out to be one of the most intense games ever. And to top it off, this is a hero I barely play, with 21 matches in total. This is going to be absolutely naughty. I could already feel it. This Benedetta is actually pretty decent, she alone will cause complete chaos in my entire team. No way they're still fighting. As the jungler, I need to farm as quickly as possible or else I'll be falling way behind from my counterpart. Damn, she was even able to last hit it. It's just a moment away. My head hurts. Smiley face. I need to regain some of my HP first by clearing this camp before contesting for the turtle, which is definitely gonna be a team fight. Since their jungler had just died, maybe I could try to steal his blue. It's clear Benedetta is gonna gain the top lane. I'm gonna warn my marksman. Well, I tried. If she was an active viewer, she definitely would have mastered the art of map awareness. Long forgotten me. Launch attack. Oh, Teammates didn't seem to be in good position to follow up, so I really couldn't go in.
Count how many times I will try to cast my ult. Took me 3 times to finally cast it. How did she not die? I thought my first kill, delay damage, would surely have her. Oof, that was extremely close call. No wonder, Beatrix and Benedetta are extremely fed already. Just look at their gold income, and Benedetta already got 9 kills. This is looking very dicey already. They are just doing whatever they want at this point. Light to darkness. Not just a moment away. I cannot use my ult carelessly because she can simply immune it with her second skill. Now I see. Our values walk right into Benedetta's old. He really wants his creep. Benedetta is coming from behind. It's always easy to give up whenever you are faced with adversity, and that's what you must do what others are not willing to do if you want to succeed. Yup, I'm feeling a little bit inspirational now, after having a very interesting dream. I just saw Yin dashing, I can go for him now. Oh, 
Choyos gave him a target to hold. Let's build Blay Armor to counter Beatrix a little bit. They are doing the lore now. We can actually contest it if we don't get caught off. Nice kick. I gotta use Retribution. This kill is really important. That went extremely well. Finally, we're starting to turn the tide a little bit. Game guys. I might actually do that if she keeps spamming surrender. I'm gonna wait for the Beatrix. Wow, these fights are something else. Lots of back and forth. Nice catch. Let's see if we can actually catch Benedetta by surprise, but it's going to be a tall task. Legendary. Now that the main threat is gone, we should definitely try to go for the Lord. Always try to reduce their number as much as possible before fully committing for the neutral objectives. Things are going extremely well.
Why every time it seems like we are winning the early fight, we always end up in this situation? But not gonna lie, it's actually pretty fun. Instead of molding, I was actually enjoying the game quite a bit. I could have fully committed there, but Nana could CC me, and then I would be instantly bursted by them. Our Melissa does need to come as well. Welp, now our mid is exposed. I will wait for her to dash first before casting my ult. I will pretend to take the Lord, but in reality, I'm just using it as a bait and hopefully we can pick some of them off. It's okay, I have lost a spell vamp, I can recover all my HP easily. By the way, those who keep spamming the surrender button every single time they die are such lovely people, smiley face. This Benedetta is actually nuts. Teresla's ult actually has a very low cooldown. I didn't know about it until now. Beatrix is shooting mosquitoes. I can't believe we actually managed to do it. What a fun game to start the day. 
Anyway, thanks for watching and I really hope you enjoyed this gameplay. I will see you on the next video.